This is probably nearby to the place on Westminster Embankment where Vaughan Williams was thinking when he was giving some sort of programme note for the third movement of his London Symphony. He talks about Westminster Embankment, he talks about the great hotels behind, he talks about the hustle and bustle of the Strand. Probably a lot more traffic noise from this part of the area than there was then. Wonderful piece to listen to with its grandeur, quite a lot of almost warlike martial moments, but a lot of tenderness, a lot of menace, a lot of hustle and bustle, a bit like that, and, and noise too. So, wonderful wide-ranging piece. Although the Westminster chimes only appear for a few seconds um, at the beginning and near the end of Vaughan Williams' London Symphony, um, Big Ben, which you see behind me, would have been very, very important as a symbol of London um, to Vaughan Williams. He did say that this was a symphony by a Londoner as a guide to listen to it, and it's a great and colourful symphony about a great and colourful city.